Hello everyone, this is Eric Long, your general manager. Today is August 23rd and I wanted to give you some updates from our uh, construction site. You can see behind us, this is the administrative building. We're almost complete. We have a couple finishing touches. Still the railing needs to be complete. Uh, you can see that the pavers have started in this area. Uh, we do have a small privacy fence that will go to hide the uh, air conditioning units and some touch up paint areas as well. Um, but we're gonna start opening uh, this building on Tuesday. So the mobile trailer, like we stated last week, will be moved. Um, and then we'll have the pro shop staff and the administrative staff will be all in this building until we open up a new golf club. We are standing on Lakes 9 and I wanted to show you a different perspective of the clubhouse. You can see behind us the building. Uh, it's really starting to take shape. The stucco is complete. They're starting the stonework uh, very shortly. And uh, you'll see in a second, I'll show you the uh, tongue and groove on the back side of the clubhouse. Uh, they have still have some things that need to be painted back there, but the color still is neutral ground. So you might see a two-tone gray in neutral ground. It will be more the neutral ground. And then the trim color is a fawn brindle. So that will be coming up shortly, but uh, you can see behind us, it's really taking shape. And reminder that those uh, rooftop units will be getting the vertical louvers, which are those decorative louvers. So they'll kind of just blend in with the, uh, the space. So I'm right on the driving range. You can see behind us the clubhouse and the pavilion space, and it's really uh, starting to take shape. Uh, I did mention last week about the downspouts being installed. They are installed now, so we can get the uh, prep work done uh, so we can start laying pavers on the back side of the clubhouse. Uh, the rains have continued every single day and I can hear it as we speak. But uh, as soon as those are complete, we'll be able to uh, get the uh, pavers in and then uh, start working on some of the landscaping and uh, grading on the back side of the clubhouse. We're located in front of the clubhouse. You can see that they're starting to work on the grading. Uh, they've removed a lot of the asphalt. This will be all pavers going out to the street. And uh, we're also starting on Monday, we'll start removing some of the uh, dead plants and getting all this area starting to look uh, good and, and, and in shape. We also will uh, update some of the irrigation as well. And uh, you really start seeing this uh, start to take shape within the next few weeks. We're located in the ladies restroom. This is just offset from the uh, lobby. You can see that they've started the vanity work here and then the tile work and the toilets have started to be installed. Uh, the first uh, coat of Prime has been in and then well, obviously they'll have some more paint colors coming but it's really transforming well and you'll see some more features very shortly. We're located in the Pro Shop. You can see some of the cabinetry that's been uh, displayed here and this will eventually go throughout the different uh, areas of the uh, clubhouse. We do have some decorative pieces going here, the shiplap wall, all around the perimeter, also the Pro, pro Shop desk. So it's going to start uh, transforming very shortly and uh, we'll see some more progress very soon. We're located in the Vista room. You can see behind us a lot of the trim work and baseboards are here. They're on site. They're starting to uh, get it all framed in and ready to go. I want to feature right now what they just installed. If we can go over to the uh, Euro doors. You can see they put in the casings already. And they started to put them all the way through. We have more cabinetry behind us. A lot of this uh, goes in various areas, the service station as well. So you can see it's a, a nice uh, tone color and it works well with the space. So you'll see these areas on all the service areas and in the break room as well. And uh, it's really looking nice. So we're located in the pub. You can see behind us, they're starting to work on the uh, bar. It's really uh, a great focal feature. We're inside the main kitchen. Uh, they've completed the flooring for the uh, main kitchen and the pavilion space. They're doing some final touches, uh, but you can see it's a nice gray in color. They also have added some more sheet metal that goes on top of the uh, hoods. Uh, they will start on the grids next week and then following up with the uh, kitchen equipment coming in the following after that. And we are in the employee break room and I just wanted to feature that they do, are putting in the grids for the ceiling. So all the service areas is getting grid systems. So they're starting here and they've worked and completed about five rooms and they've got about five more to go. 
You can see behind us, this is the, uh, the pavilion kitchen. They have finished the uh, flooring, it's called Polycrete. It's a four, uh, four step process and they're all complete here. So it's just curing as we speak and they'll be able to do some more work in there shortly. We are on the terrace as we speak and you can see above us, the tongue and groove has started to be installed. Uh, the gentlemen are working very hard. It's a beautiful product and you'll see it here. And then you also see it on the pump space and then continuing on into the pavilion. It's really starting to look really nice. We are on the pavilion space and you can see uh, they're starting to put the uh, hostess stand together. This is an action shot we got going on here. So uh, if you take a, another look over here, you can see the bar is uh, starting to really look nice and uh, they'll have stonework on the bottom here. And uh, we'll see about 12 seats on this bar and then seating over here. And again, we do remember we have the uh, fire, or fire pit in the middle and then the tongue and groove ceiling above.